out there serving a lifelong prison sentence, God has him in a process, right? And it's not necessarily a good one. Man, oh man, not a good one. But those last chapters of your New Testaments, 22 altogether, hallelujah, what does He do? He's given a revelation of Christ. Praise God. And a process was used in order to deliver that revelation to Him. And He in turn delivers it to us. Praise God. So dear ones, precious church family, please, learn to discipline yourselves not to lament the process. When God is not doing what you want Him to do at a given interval, understand that He is not in silence to your prayers, but instead that He is working a process and the ultimate objective will be that of revealing Himself. Let me just add one more. <laughs> Say one doesn't need anything. Let me close with this for sure though. In 19, 1988, I moved my family from the Lord part of South Carolina to Missouri to work through Bible college. And I thought that was the definite will of God. Believed it then, believe it now. And it seemed like Murphy's Law was in effect that everything that could go wrong did go wrong. It's like almost you know every step of the way. It's a long story. Four hard years out there trying to provide for my family and work through college and all that nine yards of stuff. And um, man, I remember thinking, Lord, why do you make it so hard? Why do things have to be this way? I'm out here trying to pursue what I think is your call for my life and uh, work through some sort of educational system. And it's like everywhere I turn, there's a block wall. Why, Lord, do you have to make it so hard? The Lord really didn't answer that question. Although it was thought many times. But here is the word the Lord put in my heart and it has become a favorite passage. It's found in 1 Corinthians chapter 1 and verse 9. The Apostle's words. He says, God is faithful by whom you were called into the fellowship of His Son Jesus Christ our Lord. Four years, so many hardships, things that I never imagined were confronting me. But Brother O'Shields, out of it, the Lord showed me that He is faithful. And that has been a staple in my life ever since. Because there has been valleys and mountains and hardships and obstacles. But the Lord revealed Himself years ago, folks, uh, that He is faithful. And He used... Uh, a years long experience in order to produce that revelation. God bless you, dear ones. Love and prayers to all of you. Pastor O'Shea.